after you sign up for your abcmouse.com teacher account it's going to ask you to begin adding your students and you'll just find this blue add a student button click that add plus sign and what I'm doing in this case is I'm just typing in the word teacher and a number but you of course will be typing in your students first and last name you can choose an avatar for them they can change that on their own eventually and then what grade level are they and then done and you just keep doing that until you've got all your students added once you have all your students in you can go and print a student list and the student list can be saved and sent to the parents it has an empty space for email address because I didn't type an email address for everybody and this can be sent home to the parents so that they can use the website at home and we'll talk more about the difference between the home and the school account when we are together at the workshop I'm going to close this window and I'm going to choose next we're not going to create profiles for the students at this time so I'm just going to say no thanks we can print home access invitations so if I say print invitations again we're going to get a very nice pre-made email that you can send to your teachers I mean not your teachers your parents and what I usually did was I added an extra little email uh, or a letter from myself to make sure they understood that they had absolutely no obligation to make any purchase on this website. I'm going to close this window and I'm going to continue to the site. And what you do at the school is you sign on as the teacher on each of the computers. And when you're signed on as a teacher on each of the computers, you're able to see the, um, the school. I'm going to say change user and when I do that this is what your student will see every time that they log on and instead of it saying teacher 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and so on you are going to actually get um, the students names there which makes it easier for them um, before I actually do this class, I might go back and change this to one teacher, two teacher, three teacher, and so on, so that it's easier for us to see in class. But this would be your actual student's name.